Motherboards are considered the heart of any computer you use. This is mainly because they contain important components such as the memory and CPU, central processing unit. In this video, we are going to discuss in detail the types of motherboards in order to help you understand how they differ from one another. Number 1. AT Motherboard. These motherboards have bigger physical dimensions of hundreds of millimeters and hence they are not the right fit for the mini desktop category of computers. Bigger physical size also inhibits installing new drivers. Sockets and 6-pin plugs are used as power connectors in these motherboards. These power connectors are not that easily identifiable and hence users face difficulties in connecting and using it. Number 2. ATX Motherboard. ATX denotes Advanced Technology Extended, it was developed by Intel during the 1990s and it was an improved version over an earlier version of AT Motherboard. It is smaller in size when compared to AT and it provides interchangeability of the connected components. There is a marked improvement in the connector aspects. Number 3. LPX Motherboard. This board had two improvements over earlier versions. The first one is input and output ports were taken to backside and the second one was the introduction of riser card to facilitate more slots and easier connection. Some of these features were deployed in the AT motherboard. The main disadvantage in this board is the lack of accelerated graphic port, AGP slots which led to a direct connection to PCI. Issues in these motherboards were addressed in NLX boards. Number 4. BTX Motherboard. BTX denotes Balanced Technology Extended, intended to manage demands of new technologies in terms of more power requirements hence generation of more heat. Intel stopped further development of BTX boards during the mid-2000s to concentrate on low-power CPU. Number 5. Pico BTX Motherboard. These boards are smaller in size and hence the word Pico. Two expansion slots are supported in spite of being sharing the top half of BTX. Half-height or riser cards are its unique features and it supports the demands of digital applications. Number 6. Mini ITX Motherboard. It's a miniature version of motherboard over its earlier versions. Designed in the early 2000s and its dimension is 17x17 cm mainly used in small form factor, SFF computer due to its lower power consumption and faster cooling ability. This motherboard is the most preferred in the home theater domain due to its lower level of fan noise that will improve the quality of the theater system.